Okay, so we had one of our subscribers, Annie, um, give us a hint about our grapes. She said to thin them out, thin out the clusters so that the rest of them get plump. Uh, so we're gonna do that. Well, Caleb's gonna do that, and I'm gonna video him doing it, because I think you'd rather watch him than me. And we'll do this, and then we'll give you a follow-up um, once these all ripen to let you know how it goes. What we're gonna do is pick off the ones that have blemishes first, and then what, Caleb? Pick off all the smallest. Pick off all the smallest ones from the clusters. Nice looking cluster, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Look at that. What do you think, Caleb? You think it's going to be worth it doing this? We'll see. We'll see, hopefully, huh? <clears throat> so look at this viney coming through. Is this from that other tree? Was this wisteria? Um. Maybe? I don't remember. We pruned it way back and it's coming into the grapes again. <laughs> and right here. You can see it coming through. That's just crazy. Man, this, these guys are going to be getting, getting right in no time. <clears throat> I thinned that one out already. Got that one pretty good. Not that one. Not very big yet. Well then just pluck off um, a few from the ends. That's what uh, Annie said to do. Just pluck off like four from the end. Probably the, you know, the smallest one. So. Yeah. Cool? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we've had quite a few people ask how mom's doing after she broke her ankle and recently she went and got her ankle casted and so let's go see if we can get an update and see how she's doing. Okay, come on buddy, let's go say hi to grandma. They brought their trailer which has been great. Here you go. Okay, so here's mom. Here's her new cast. Right now she's got it wrapped in a cold thing with bobber. So how you doing, mom? Well, I'm doing a lot of laying around and sitting around. <laughs> Just lazing, huh? Lazing, yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. And how's how's it feeling? Is it feeling a little better than it was before? Well, from the start, yeah, better from the start, but still I have issues of ongoing coming and going pain coming so okay have to put it up and put ice on it sometimes so if you have a prayer request what would it be that I can walk that you can walk <laughs> with two feet you want to say anything to all the people that that have been praying for you and everything thank you for your prayers all of you very much appreciated yeah so mom's got this this walker thing of a bobber here that she's using in the trailer. And there's Papa. It's Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. You want to say anything to all the fathers out there? Words of inspiration, encouragement? Do the right thing for your kids and be there as an example. Hmm. And uh, if you don't have your uh, faith in God, and Christ is your Savior, he's the one to look for to be able to give that example that is needed mm -hmm. in this world. Very cool. Thank you. So thank you so much to all who have been praying for my mom. It's much appreciated. <laughs> with grandpa. Hey. Was that fun? Yeah. It was fun, huh? Okay. So, Josh came in and found... Where's its head? Hiding. It's swallowing an egg. Right there. They can't, they can't bite when they're swallowing an egg. He is. He just let go of the egg. He really, really... He's trying to rattle his tail. 
snakes think you're a rattlesnake. It's not. It's just a big old black snake. We need to get him. He's trying to eat all the eggs. That's what he's doing. Here you go, Josh. We need to get him yeah, away from the eggs. Okay, a quick side note on this update that we did with the thinning out the grapes and update for mom and all of that is that we'll be back to our Sharing Our Journey series uh, on for Wednesday's vlog. What are you doing up here, Crater? Just being up here with potato. Just being up here with some potato? Mm. Not in the bag of the potato. Like a bag of old potato. I, I don't know where the bag. You don't know where the bag of potatoes is at? No. W what are we supposed to do with those potatoes? Plant them. Plant them. Those yeah. are seed potatoes, aren't they? Mm mm. Yeah, at apple potato. Uh huh. I call them apple potatoes. You call them apple potatoes? Are we planting them right there? We're, we're planting them right there. Mm hmm. Uh huh. I do suppose with my job of climbing roofs for hours <clears throat> uh, all these days, I guess he comes by the climbing natural. I guess he kind of gets it from me. I know I used to make my mom a nervous wreck. I would climb up on top of things when I was a little guy. <clears throat> when I was really little, I would, I would climb up on top of things. I don't even remember this. It was before I can remember. I would climb up on the refrigerator and say, I jump, and then I would jump. And apparently I would climb up on all kinds of stuff. And I would say, and I jump. Can climb on here too. And my mom knew that meant I was jumping, whether anybody was there to catch me or not. And she would have to come running and catch me from wherever I was jumping at. Say turtle. Turtle. I need a turtle. I need a bat. Yeah. <laughs>